Can men menstruate? Yes. Oh, uh, yeah. No. Hell no, nah, men can't menstruate. I'm, I'm talking about a real man. No. I don't see that happening. Why not? Y'all don't have the organs for that, but we do. I'm talking about like a real man. Yeah. Trans men are real men. You don't have to be a, have to have a dick to be a man. Like sexual parts don't necessarily have to correlate with what you technically think of what a man is or what a man would have. What would you say to all the college kids that say, yes, men can menstruate? Put the crack down. You got to stop smoking crack. Like, it's just not possible. Like, we don't have the tools inside for that to actually happen. Can men bleed from their vaginas? My son hasn't. But do you think he can in the future? Probably dehydration. Men can't physically get their period, correct? I wouldn't say that. Why? Because, like, depends on how you define men. Because I feel like people can identify as a man or they would call themselves a man and they don't, they can't physically. I don't think that men can have periods since, since I've been on this earth, nor do I know of any men that had babies other than getting a woman pregnant. Her sign not male at birth, you know, it's possible. You can be a real man and have a period. And what would you say to all the everyone who says no? Y'all are stupid, uneducated. And what would you say to all the people who say yes? Where are you buying your drugs? Can you share? Can a man physically have their period? Again, if they're trans, no. And what would you say to all the college kids that say yes? Learn your organs. What would you say to someone who says no, that, that they can't? Learn what trans people are. Like. A real man, technical real man, cannot menstruate. Sorry. You can't. I mean, no man can ever menstruate. Thank God. Shouldn't we be happy that we can't? I'm so confused. How is this? What? But if you are born sex, I like female sex at birth, but you identify as male, then you can't. So do you think men can bleed from their vaginas? It's a mental vagina that you're talking about. Not the physical, the mental. Bleed from the mental vagina in the mind. If a woman identifies as a man, now men can menstruate. Yeah, I, I would agree. Some people, it's like when a woman decides she wants to identify as a man, she can, she can be a man that menstruates. Does that make sense? Hell no. It doesn't add up. One plus one equals two. Well, there's a difference between sex and gender. You know, sex is generally, you know, what you're born with. Sex is biological. Uh, gender... isn't, you, isn't your gender the same thing? It is not. Like, just because I have a penis doesn't mean you need to call me a man, doesn't mean you need to use, like, he, him pronouns on me. But doesn't that make you a man? That That's what you're born with? Biologically, that would make me a man, but gender-wise, not necessarily. So what would that make you, then? It, Gender-wise, it could be whatever I want to be. So if she's a female and she still has a vagina? Yeah, but she identifies as a man. Doesn't matter. You can identify as a duck, but you can't fly. So if a woman identifies as a man, now, she, now they can menstruate? No. Because just because you identify as something, that doesn't mean that's what you are. And the reason I say that is because I can go out here right now and do a criminal act. When the cops come, I can look at them and say, I identify as innocent. Is that going to stop them from locking me up? Same, same situation. Biological men cannot physically get their period, correct? Correct. So if a woman identifies as a man, now men can menstruate? Um, well, if a woman identifies as a man, then they're a man. Right. So if a woman identifies as a man, now men can menstruate? If you put it that way, maybe.